What about him? Huh? Oh, you mean Naruto. He leaves the village this morning to begin his training with Jiraiya. Jiraiya? One of the Sanin? He's the one admired by every guy in the league who ranks at the top of the list of masters people most want to train with? He even might have been stronger than Sasuke and his dad. magnificent game you can while you're waiting because do you have anything better to do really why not pick the best thing possible that you can do because you're more powerful than you think way more powerful than you think i mean god only knows what you are in the final analysis you're blind to your own weaknesses but you're also blind to your own strengths it's like how far could you take that if you stopped wasting time and if you stopped lying and if you oriented yourself to to the highest possible good that you could conceive of and you committed to that how much good could you do? Well, I would say, why don't you find out? Because there's a real utility in knowing that you're a monster. Now, just because you're a monster doesn't mean you have to be a monster, but it's really useful to know that you are one. Everything horrible that human beings have done was done <sighs> by human beings and more And so if you don't understand that, and to understand that really means to know how it was that you could have done it, and that's a shadowy thing. To try to imagine that, to try to imagine yourself as someone who's engaged in medieval torture, to see how you could, in fact, do that. You're never the same when you do that. But being never the same after learning that is unbelievable. Because when you really know that that's what you're like, then you're a whole different person. You cannot be a good person until you know how much evil you can take with you. I hope you don't mind one more round, old fella. to win, you have to close the deal. It's an old problem. Remember when 
when you fought Majin Buu, after the Elder Kai drew out your power, you were overcome by a different feeling. Arrogance. You'd struggled for so long to unlock your potential, and when you did, you enjoyed it too much. Instead of using your strength to win, your arrogance left you open to attack. Succumb to that again, and you'll lose no matter how powerful you are. Be a warrior. No matter the opponent, you fight with everything you've got. He got that big from working in a fucking sand mine. Oh my god. This is, I mean, he literally was like Conan the Barbarian. I was about 10 years old. We had to work to contribute at home. Dad's work was to be for adults that we didn't have any option. Get back home shitty because all day long he's been raining, so you have to stay active. As soon as you stop working, moving, you get cold, you just get freezing, so you get active. We have a machine out there called the Power Cube, and that machine, Francis, registered the highest ever. 